Welcome to the Brickyard 400 vlog. I just bought a 124 Kmart car. Um, they're telling us that we can't bring our, our assault rifles in, which is or our rollerblades. So um, we're very disappointed. Uh, so we're hanging out. We're not gone in yet because we're looking at the uh, the gypsy tents, as Rob calls them. Gypsy tent. This, well, this is quite true. Um, and uh, ready for a good brickyard today. We got tickets. We got to tell these guys. You know, we, we're, we're wearing Buddy Lazier and Lugano. You were Lugano. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. Uh, we're wearing, we're wearing full-on racing gear. And they're asking us if we have tickets. Well, maybe they want to buy our tickets because we want to make those stands look even more empty today. Well, you see, Sam. You just yeah, play you wrong. So... We are, uh, yeah, we're, we're in for a good race today. Not official ticket holder here, guys. Today's I don't, race. We'll see. There you go. An official ticket holder. That's better. All right. So uh, we will uh, reconvene when we go to the Fanatics tent. Yes. Because uh, everybody wants to see the Fanatics tent because yes. apparently it's like senpai for yes. NASCAR people. So. People with IndyCar stuff on. Just recording. Oh, really? Yes. Yay, more IndyCar people. I'm not the only one. All right. I just had to look at this. Like, wh what is this? Exactly, I don't understand this. Why is this a thing? Who buys, <laughs> who buys that? You could put it on your cat. Oh, that, that's Diecast no. Reviews, a.k.a. Brody Banta, a.k.a. He's My got... My social security oh, number is... It's a color chrome. It's a color chrome Kmart car. Oh, Little Caesars. <laughs> Little Caesars. Yeah. So, yeah, so we're in the, we're in the, I guess Rob calls them gypsy tents. Yeah. And there's all sorts of diecast that you guys probably are more excited about than I am. But... I'm going to actually, yeah, I'm going to purchase this, so. Okay, so, we are headed into the Fanatics tent. I've never been in these, so, this will be an experience. Where's Patrick Carpentier? Kyle Larson is in his own little section with the other guys. Let's see what Kyle Larson stuff they've got. Ooh, they got... Should you get that for Buddy? Yes. Okay, so I don't want a target hat. Oh, this is women's? What? No. It says women's right there. It says women's right there. Okay, there we go. Ladies fit. Not ladies fit. You want that one? Man, get, get that off the screen. No, oh, get it out of there. Oh. I want to show, show the IndyCar hat. I Look, you're talking I've got about an IndyCar hat. hat. I'm not going to buy it, but there's actually IndyCar merchandise in <laughs> Fanatics. Yep. I'd like to point out, I, that's a cool Goodyear shirt, but I'm worried it's going to blow up. Uh, we're this is as close as I'm going to get to Kyle Larson all weekend, so I figured uh, I'd film it. Also, I bought his hat. Failed, so and he didn't notice me. Kyle! I, no, so I bought your hat! The, the notice me, trailer. Senpai! Uh, notice me! That I don't, I have never done before. What? Oh no! That's Chase Elliott. Oh yeah, yeah, 88. Why is Chase Elliott or Chase Elliott all the way down there? Anyway, we're doing something that I've never done before, which is weird considering how long I've been here. But I'm actually walking on the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Uh, we're about to run the Hildebrand line here out of four. Um, this is, uh, part of my friend's badass. Uh, it's what Kyle Larson's gonna be doing today. So, we're in front of Patrick Carpentier's number 32. Uh, he's number 32 in your program, number one in your heart, and number 40th on your starting grid. He's also gonna win today. Um, and now in a, in a serious, not serious pick, uh, or in serious picks, uh, Mr. Banta, who, who are you going with right. in your official? Kyle Busch and Tony Stewart. But who is your official pick? Kyle Busch. Kyle Busch, is, Kyle Busch is his official pick. He's picking the pole sitter, so that's a complete cop out. Um, I am going to go with, thought about this. There's three guys I think I could, that could do it today. I think Brad Keselowski. I think that's, I think he could possibly get Pesky's first Brickyard 400 win. I also 
believe um, that it might be Truex, but my pick is going to be Chase Elliott. And I'm going to sound like a fanboy, but I'm not, I assure you, because of the hat I'm wearing, that I'm not a Chase Elliott fanboy, but Chase Elliott's going to win today. It's going it's to blow up Instagram, it's going to blow up Twitter, it's going to blow up everything. If you say so. So, mark my words, reporting from the, the real winner of this race, Patrick Carpentier's car. He's back. 